Anya and the Purple Butterfly Poor Anya is ill and all alone indoors. She's bored as she lies in bed all day, while all the other children laugh and play. She stares sadly out of the window. Suddenly, Anya sees something above her favourite tree. What can it be? A small moving purple speck? Then it disappears. Oh, there it is, across the garden, through the window, and straight onto her fingertips. Anya gasps. It is a purple butterfly. Butterfly, she whispers. Oh, how I wish I could fly, just like you up in the sky. You flew so quickly and so high. Hmm, said the butterfly. If you like, I'll tell you why. I can fly. Oh, yes, please, said Anya eagerly. Well, began the butterfly. Once upon a time, I was a small green caterpillar. Just like all the other caterpillars, I ate, then rested, and ate some more, then rested some more. That was all very nice and easy. But there were some things I was very afraid of. I was afraid of birds with their big sharp claws and pointed beaks and loud cries. I knew they wanted to eat me up or feed me to their hungry babies. I was afraid of the rain that beats down, sometimes so hard that it almost knocked me off my branch and into the puddles on the ground. I was terrified of falling off because caterpillars cannot swim. Even though I could eat as many tasty leaves as I could possibly want, I became tired of hiding from the birds and tired of trying to shelter from the rain. So tired, I had to stop and rest. I found a branch and wrapped myself up in a cosy chrysalis. It was dark and quiet. I was all alone with no one to turn to. I wondered if I would ever feel any better. All I could do was wait another day. After a while, though, I wasn't tired anymore. And then I didn't feel afraid. I felt strong. I stretched and pushed my way out. In all that time, something amazing had happened. I had wings. I had become a purple butterfly. I was a butterfly and I could fly. I flew high into the clouds and sky. I saw how beautiful the world is and how people smile, happy to see me flutter by. In the butterfly garden, I soared with the other butterflies. We danced amongst the flowers, weaving and whirling. We drank sweet nectar. We all flew high. You see, I was tired, alone and afraid. Then I stopped to rest for a while. Look what happened. Everything changed. It's not just me. This happens to moths and dragonflies. And maybe even to little people. With that, the butterfly gently fluttered its wings tickling Anya's fingers, and then flew away. Anya sat up. She sat up and smiled. At bedtime, Anya thought about the purple butterfly. As she fell asleep, she imagined all the butterflies flying about together, so happy that the whole world smiled. And that night, as she dreamt, Anya flew over the rainbow and under the stars. You are more than what you see and everything